Welcome to Survival on a Budget Made Easy. We're taking a look at Frey Organic Red, Red Table Wine from California. Now for those of you who don't already know, I'm not a real big fan of red wine. But I never had organic red wine. Uh, alcohol, 13.9% by volume. Medium body, well balanced and smooth. This wine pairs well with a wide variety of cuisine from picnic fair to holiday feast. Starting with grapes grown on organic family farms, this wine was crafted in accordance with USDA organic winemaking standards. I'm really not sure what the difference is between regular grain wines and organic wines. Maybe in the pesticides and fertilizer. I'm not real sure. But we're gonna go ahead and give it a try. I think this, I know this bottle was under $10. I'm thinking it was around six. I wish I would have kept the receipt or at least wrote the price on the bottle. And no GMOs. I gotta be honest, if I actually like this, I'm gonna be surprised because, like I said before, I really do not like red wines. But I keep trying them and hopes one day I find one I like. And it has been chilled, it's been in the refrigerator for, I'm gonna say, two days now. It has, it does actually have a nice grape smell to it. It's not strong or overpowering. Well, I gotta say, it is quite pleasant. Let's get you a close up look of it. Yeah. I like to do that so you guys see there's like no sediments in there. Because trust me, I, I've seen floaters in wine before. Let's go ahead. Give it a little taste. One more. I don't know what it is about red wine. I think it lacks the sweetness that I like or something. But I gotta say, this is actually one of the, one of the better red wines. It's not it's not gonna make me a red wine drinker, but I'm gonna keep trying red wine. But this is the first time I actually had a red wine. That was wasn't really felt like I was being over. No, it was overbearing. A lot of them have like a vinegary taste to it, and it doesn't have that. I, I, I'm, I'm kind of a loss for words because I'm, I'm kind of surprised. I, I really don't like it, but considering it's a red wine, I really don't hate it. You know, I, I think I'm going to probably give this a three. If you're a red wine drinker, i definitely check this out because like I said, I really don't like red wine, but... This, this ain't really all that bad. I, I'm impressed. Okay, do me a favor, click on that subscribe button, and as always, thank you for watching.